Hey guys, me here, and today I created a printer. I kept it open just so you can see what it looks like, so I don't have to really explain it. It's be well, I won't explain it anyway. It's basically all these pistons are pointing in the sand blocks, and all these repeaters are facing into the pistons. All this redstone is facing into the repeaters. And this piece of redstone facing into that redstone, all this is a redstone block. I'll show you to make that really quick. And all of them are set on full. So you're going to do something like this, and then you're going to set all of them to full, like this. And then you're going to put redstone down. And then once you activate it with, it should, oops, I forgot to put redstone on the other sides, lock this, yep, that should press this out like this. So, first we need to put a design down here, it doesn't matter what you use down here. So, I'm going to do something like this, like that, like that, like that, like that, like that, like that, and none right there. So basically, all these pistons are facing up into black wool. So when I place redstone torches on each of these, it won't, or it will push up the white wool. Or it'll push up the black wool into the white wool, and the white wool will move up one. And yeah, basically that. Then, once you've done all this, you have to break all these. And then your design will be ready. If you don't get rid of these, the printer will malfunction and it'll basically be like the out of ink setting. Even though there's still ink in there, it'll malfunction like that. So now, Okay, I may have malfunctioned my own printer. What did I do? <laughs> what in the world? I do not know what happened here. What happened? Okay, oh well. But it printed out. I messed up badly. Let me fix this. I'll be right back. Guys, I made a big, huge mistake. Do not remove it. Do not. Whatever you do, do not remove those things down there. Do not remove them when you build this. It will mess up your printer. And then you'll have to reset the whole printer, which means I have to remove all this. So it's going to take me a little bit. But I'll show you the working product of this printer. Okay, so who doesn't mess up on the first try? Uh, the second time is the charm. They all say that right. Now they do. Please work. Okay, so what you do is... 
I've already showed you this before. I'm just gonna make like a little piano. Um, yeah, a little piano. So about that long, maybe. Quick reminder, it doesn't matter what ink you use, or what you use for the bottom, uh, like for this, because it's just going to copy the design, guys, and do not break these, do not, remember what happened last time, do not break them, that was horrible. It took a while to reset, but it should work this time. Okay, do not break those. So you see what's happened here. Now, we set this up. Oh, oof. I did that wrong. Watch as my piano prints out. Oh, you have to look at it from this way. Okay, yeah. You have to look at it from this way. And there's my piano. So basically how this is built, it's pretty simple. All you do is you take... You take this and it simply presses... All these um, pistons press this uh, sand, which has to be the same length right here. It presses that into, or it presses the sand into the design that you've made down here with all these pistons that press up whenever you put a torch under the block under here. And this, you can make any designs. I'll set up the printer and make another one. Okay, so I'm going to do this one. Oh great, it's snowing. Not really. That's horrible. Because if one piece of snow gets on my redstone, it will break it. Which, not good. No, not good. I'm having problems doing this one. Um, Okay, this one's kind of tricky. Okay, I think I made it. Unlock this. Okay. Can you guys guess what I'm making? I will probably make this in a survival world eventually. Oh. Okay. There we go. That's the best I could do for buy. 
So bye guys.